No matter what camera you have, it won't be perfect in certain situations. And this is where a rig comes in. A rig is a piece of equipment designed for a particular purpose. So by building a rig, you can basically turn any camera into something near perfect that fits your needs. Hi, my name is Leo and today we are going to be talking about my minimalist handheld rig that I built for the Sony a7 III. Before we start, why even build a rig like this for a small mirrorless camera like the Sony a7 III? First of all, a rig allows you to customize your camera. By adding more weight and different types of handles to the camera, the footage will turn out more stable and it is easier for you to hold the camera for a long time. And let's be honest, a camera rig just looks very cool. <laughs> Here are the parts that you are gonna need. A cage for your camera, a handle, a NATO rail, a microphone, your favorite lens, and of course, your camera, in my case, the Sony a7 III. I also use a multi-tool by SmallRig. Now let's start actually building the rig. The cage that I use is the SmallRig half cage. This one in particular allows us to quickly take the camera out of the cage and put it onto a tripod or a gimbal. The first thing we are going to do is attach the Arca Swiss Type Quick Release Plate to the camera. I'm using my Sony a7 III, but SmallRig makes cages for many different cameras. Now we can simply put the camera into the cage and attach a lens. The Tamron 28-75 f2.8 is a fantastic lens if you have a Sony camera. I chose it mainly because of its versatility. Next, we need a NATO rail on the left side of the cage. This will allow us to mount our handle. The one I chose is actually a top handle, but I think it also works great as a side handle. If the rig was heavier, I would usually use a top handle. For a small setup like this, I prefer having a handle on the left side. The last thing is optional, but I always record some audio when filming. I like the Rode VideoMic Pro. Building rigs is a process of optimizing and what works for me might not work for you. Even this rig is not perfect. There are a couple of things that I would like to improve in future versions of this rig. One problem is that the camera is so front heavy that it won't stand flat on the surface. That can easily be solved by adding a longer quick release plate to the bottom of the cage. In addition to that, it would also be great to have a monitor to look at your footage more easily. I actually just bought one to put on top of the camera, but that might be a topic for another video. So that is my minimalist handheld rig for the Sony a7 III. If you found this video helpful or entertaining, please leave a like and comment if you would like to build a rig like this yourself. You can also subscribe to my channel to not miss any upcoming videos. And if you're not sure about that, you might want to check out one of those two videos. Alright, see you in the next one.